Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you what you do with all this stuff you just did. Um, you've got your Google Alert set up, and in your inbox, you'll get a digest of all the different pages, uh, blog posts, and different things that uh, Google has found on the keyword that you set up the Google Alert for. In this case, I had one for SEO software, and then I see that this Google, link, uh, Google Alert comes in for this, and I go and check out this content. So, copy that link. So when I go to this, uh, this particular page, um, you'll see here that um, this article is about SEO management, blah, blah, blah. And so, you know, I read the article, I see, is it got anything good in it? And if it does, um, you know, then I'll go ahead and clip it. And what I do is, since I'm logged into my Clipmarks account, I just click this little button in my toolbar, and we'll bring up this Clipmarks um, uh, toolbar here. And then what I do is I just select things that I want to clip. So let's say I want to clip the title, and a little orange box is going to appear around. It's sometimes a little tricky, but uh, once I have the little orange box on what I want, I just click the button, and it will say it's clipped that. And it will have how many characters left you can still clip to the, until you get to the 1,000 character limit. And I go down here, and I might want to uh, clip... Um, this entire paragraph, so I highlight it with the orange box and click that. If you only want to clip uh, just a sentence, um, you can start here and go, you know, most folks, and just, you know, highlight it like this, and then as soon as you stop highlighting, you clip the clip it thing. When you're all done, what you're going to do is click the orange click here when done clipping. And when I hit that uh, button, you're going to see what's going to happen. So I click this button, and it gives me four options. Save clip, email clip, blog clip, or print clip. I'm going to click blog clip. And again, I have to have all my settings and clip marks set up to do the clip to blog, and then this window is going to pop up. So here we are in this uh, clip marks uh, pop-up window, and here's the content over here that I just clipped. Okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a unique title for my blog. This is, again, going to be my thematic.wordpress.blog.com uh, blog. So I'm going to make a title. Um, and you can make your title SEO uh, relevant. You know, let's say I put in here SEO software for keyword research, let's say. Whatever this article is about. But uh, their title might not be as optimized as my title. Just hint, hint. Then I'm going to put my own little stuff here. And this is where it gets fun. The idea here is I want to have a keyword anchor text link going to one of my external content pages on Hub Pages, on Squiddo, or an eZine article. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm going to write some, uh, some of my own text here, a sentence or two, to comment on this article, and, uh, and then I'm going to show you how to create the link. And we'll do that in the next video.